The 14th season of Project Runway has come to an end. This year, one of the four finalists was from right here in the Bay Area. Yep. And joining us live this morning is designer Candace Cuoco. Thank you very much, Candace, for Thank coming you in. Thank for having me, guys. Congratulations. What an experience uh, to be back there at Fashion Week. Uh, were there yeah. nerves oh as you made it there that far to becoming one of the four finalists, or no nerves? Well, I mean, I always believed in myself enough to where I knew that I was going to eventually arrive there, but Project Runway just launched me. I mean, and you know, your work is so personal as an artist, and to present it to America that way, it was, it was nerves in the sense that it's so personal that you just hope that everyone enjoys it. You know, I watched the show, and uh, one of the things I always wanted like to it? ask someone, yeah, I, I did like it, um, Tim Gunn, when he comes in, he's all, this is just not going to work. You need to kick it up. And everyone looks like shocked. <laughs> that's, that's not acting, is it? I mean, you guys are like no. upset, right? When yeah. he says he doesn't like something? Yeah, because, you, I mean, you know, he's a, like a titan of the industry. Mm -hmm. And he comes in and he tells you, you know, he doesn't like your work. It's just, you're not shocked. You're taken back, like, how am I going to fix Usually this? You're immediately. Deadline, though. He says he doesn't like your work and you have, like, a little you bit of time to fix it. two hours yeah, right. left <laughs> to, like, redo the whole entire garment. But um, the kindest man in the world, Tim Gunn. No. He really is. On and off camera. You allowed us into your studio here in the Bay Area. And as we take a look at what you work on sort of in your, your, your day job, your normal life, this is from inside your studio, I'm hoping we can show you. I read that you say you design for the woman who knows exactly what she wants and knows exactly where she is going. Why then, Candace, do so many of us have a problem just getting dressed in the morning? And do you have any mm. advice for the masses on that? Yeah, you know, I, I think that um, some women struggle with their persona or who does the world want me to be? Who, who does everybody want me to be today? How should I look today? I just advise everyone to look inside and think, who do I want to be today? What do I want to feel? What do I want to present to the world? Mm -hmm. I mean, that's how I think when I get dressed every single day. And like, that's your message. When you get dressed every single day, that's your message to the world. And what do you want that message to be? What's the one material that you just love working with? I yeah. do love leather. And it could be real in, in, in faux, both. And it's because of the, what yeah, it why? embodies, the strength and the smell of it. It's like, I, I love, women inspire me, all, 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 all women. And I think that leather embodies the same, embodies of a, of a woman, mm -hmm. the, the structure and the strength and mm -hmm. the smell and the way it drapes and how it holds and reacts and how it ages. Um, I just love And leather. saying that, is there one particular individual, a star maybe that you would love to design for? Oh, I think Angelina Jolie would look amazing oh, in leather. I agree. But so would Anna Winter. Hmm. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. yeah. Very strong she, woman, yeah. very in command. Very much. Very a very clean forward, cut something, a silhouette. I think she would look stunning. We mm. brought a couple of mannequins, or you actually did, and these are a couple of your designs. Talk to us about what we're seeing here. Very ornate, very rich, very evening out. Yeah, this was my from my latest collection uh, I showed in London Fashion Week, and um, we decided to put pants into the collection this season. So we have a beaded garment here it pants in top and this is my favorite it was my finale gown and it's black silk organza where do you get the inspiration for something like this I mean, this was love. love and i think that all women can relate to that because falling you're in, love. in love right now or past experience it Ooh, would mike wow. well yeah. you know i mean first of all here on channel two news <laughs> <laughs> um I am. I am. Great. Yeah. Great. And it, it moves you to a different place in your life. Um, and, y you know, you grow from it. You change. Like, it's, and it's not a bad thing. So this season I implemented color into my collection, and I've never done that before either. So you see a, a bit of colors, a bit of ornate beading. Mm -hmm, it's, mm -hmm. it's a softer side of me. It's a bit more feminine, and I think love does that to women. That must have been difficult to make that transition to have a little pop of color in there. No, no, it, no and it's, it's the softer side, and I don't think that that was difficult at all. It, it happened very natural. Good. Can I ask you, go back to the show and ask you, when, when you pick teams, I know that that's kind of a big deal when you pick teams. Yeah. I saw you. What kind mm -hmm. of things were you looking for in those teammates sometimes you you know you shun people I thought should have been on your team but what do you what do you yeah, look for? the team challenge see what what I think is what's going on in that specific time at that moment and during that team challenge you know there had been another designer that was struggling the whole entire time and I thought well maybe I could work with her personal like personally and we could work together and so I'm gonna choose you first um, 
and then the, the, the choosing process was a bit pe peculiar that happened after that. But um, I would say that good and bad, we all learned something from each other, and we definitely took something from it. And Project Runway has changed me in a very wonderful way. Well, I loved it. It was a great experience. Yeah, yeah. we can't wait to see what yeah. you do next. Candice yes. Cuoco, thank you so much. Thank Project you, guys. Runway finalist yes. for Thank you.